this is Martin and Yannick for a King Camera news update. Uh, now we've just released uh, 1.03 of King Camera and we thought it'd be a, a great opportunity to present to you uh, the new features that are in 1.03 but also all the new features that we introduced since 1.0 and a sneak peek of what's coming up uh, to 1.1, the big update we're working on right now. So maybe Yannick, you want to take us with the, the new things in 1.03? Of course. So uh, one of the new things in 1.03 is the white vignette. You guys asked for it, so we gave it to you. It's simple. It's still in the vignettes module in Promatic, but this time we added a, a white vignette setting. So it's customizable, just like the black vignette, same thing. But now you have that nice, soft, dreamy look that you can put on your images. The next new feature is negative contrast. You guys asked for that one too, and I actually wanted that one as well. So uh, basically in this one, the, neg the contrast slider goes both ways. Before you, won't, you could only increase contrast, now you can reduce contrast. We also added uh, crop ratio 1.1, 1 .1, 1 to 1 ratio, which was a big feature that was asked by many of you out there. Uh, Yannick and I also wanted that feature. I don't know how we missed it in 1.0, but here it is in 1.0. 0.03 just for you guys and we also added recently a uh, rotation 90 degrees in case the image orientation is not to your liking so you can now rotate in the crop module 90 degrees uh, clockwise or anti-clockwise we also uh, added just for fun in 1.03 uh, a new frame it is a printer registration frame it was uh, suggested by one of the users and we thought hey why not let's make it original and bring it to king camera it is a really nice frame as well I like it too. Yeah, I like it too. Now let's talk about speed improvements. Yeah. We've done a lot of that. It's something in the background, but it's something that you guys will actually feel from 1.0 to 1.03. The first major one is the shutter button. The shutter button in camera. It's almost instantaneous now. It, it used to be around two seconds, two to three seconds between shots. Now it's almost instantaneous. You can take as many shots as you want and you're sure not to miss out on that shot. That's Next. Right. Fast Thumbs Generation exactly. in Photodesk. Uh, if you uh, import a photo from the camera roll or if you take a photo with the, your camera, uh, the, the, the thumbnails in Photodesk used to take about five seconds to generate. Right. Now it's two seconds. So it's pretty much blazing fast, uh, more than two times faster now. We also improved the uh, generation of thumbnails in? In the Quickmatic module, of course. Um, before, every time you would bring a photo into the Quickmatic module, you'd have to wait roughly about a quarter of a second for each thumb to generate. And now, if you're not actually in the Quickmatic module and your photos are in the photo desk, they will generate the thumbs in the background. Isn't that pretty cool? Even if you um, put King Camera in the background of your device, it'll keep generating the thumbs. So once you go back into Quickmatic, poof, instantaneous, all your thumbnails are created. So that's a great feature. I like that personally because it's really quick and fast and it makes the uh, overall application a lot faster. Uh, we also made a lot of visual tweaks in the application so far. The vignette module and the borders module received the visual tweaks, uh, mainly uh, to have more larger preview of your photo. So we moved things around, the sliders and stuff, and this is something we're going to continue uh, doing with the upcoming updates. Uh, mainly, let's talk about 1.1. 1 .1. Let's talk about 1.1. .1. The 1.1 that, uh, I mean, personally, I would almost call it 2.0, but... Uh, we, almost, almost. We, we just, I mean, it's very <laughs> exciting. We got many new features coming up. Bring us with the first ones. Well, the first ones are in the Promatic module. And uh, we're adding new effects for you to play with and create brand new looks. Um, we can't really talk about too much of it. We want to keep uh, the, the suspense, the, the, suspense, the secret. Yeah, the, the big new effects to create brand new looks. Well, actually, the texturizer. Yeah, let's, let's, yeah. yeah let's talk about the texturizer. It's actually being revamped completely. Um, our programmers are working hard on that one. Um, you guys wanted it. We wanted it. How about adding more than one texture to your photo? Exactly. That's a big thing coming up, a new visual way of presenting it as well, mm -hmm. but uh, the ability of adding more than one texture on top of your photo. We are also working very hard on the visual enhancements of the King Camera applications, the user interface. We want it to make it a better user experience, larger photo previews overall in the modules, and uh, enhanced user interface graphics as well overall in the uh, application. Yes. But 
last but not least. The last but not least, a big one, a personal favorite of mine. Go ahead. Exactly. It's really a new feature that will be found in the photo desk. Um, and it'll change the way you manage your photo looks. It's gonna be lightning fast, you're gonna go, wow, I can't believe no one thought yeah. about this before. We don't wanna say too much, but no. seriously, this is a big, big feature coming in a photo desk when you wanna manage multiple photos and you, you're, you're using your looks and, I don't wanna say too much, but hey, it's gonna be really, really good. I look forward to show you that uh, feature. Exactly, well, there you have it. All that's been done since 1.0, since our release about four to five weeks ago. We've already done three updates. A fourth one is coming next week. I mean, we just keep on pumping those updates. And thank you for your support. We have made the top three in the photo uh, section of the App Store, which is uh, excellent. We are so uh, grateful. Uh, for that and uh, also uh, top 50 overall apps in the app store we exactly. reached up uh, wow. all the way up to 30 so I mean seriously thank you for your support please uh, pass the word around tell your friends about King Camera this is the way it works and uh, with your support and your help I mean we're gonna make this application top notch top notch and number one so thank you very much and we'll talk to you soon bye bye <laughs>